Evening, we received incredible video from a neighbor showing a lightning strike hitting this power box last night near North Division and Gordon. And that strike caused sparks, which then caught two garages on fire and severely damaged the nearby homes. Whoa! This neighbor was filming at the right place at the right time, hoping to capture a lightning strike, but this one came much closer than anticipated. If you were a professional photographer, you probably would never get that lucky. Spokane Fire Chief Brian Schaefer says lightning strikes like this don't happen very often in the city, but last night's storm was significant because he says there were multiple hits and fires last night. One of the homeowners whose home was damaged by the fire says he's grateful for the fire department preventing it from getting any worse. This is just one of those incidents that we had to adapt the resources we had available to respond to. Uh, an incident that had progressed past just the initial lightning strike to the box, but also to the nearby shrubbery grass and uh, uh, structures that were nearby. So unfortunately we did lose a couple structures, but at the same time we saved several that were very close proximity to where the fires were. Taking a closer look at the damage here in the backyard, you can see this home here. The siding started to melt off. It got so hot from that fire. Now the residents living here at this home, they are able to stay here, but they do not have power. Their next door neighbors roof caught on fire from those sparks last night. They've actually had to vacate the home. They're now staying at a hotel. We're here just in the last few hours. We've seen a Vista cruise here working to restore that power again because that resident is without reporting from North Spokane. Amanda Rowley, Crumb 2 News.